does well under pressure and getting away from Britain and the kick out from Howie there had caused problems Another well, pushing men forward now what an opportunity and a fine save by Ian Westwater well that was a real opportunity for Owen Kyle suddenly the Dunfermline were all over the place defensively just look at this and the ball broke then for Owen Coyle. It looked as though he'd pick his spot, but Westwater made up ground and did just enough to deflect the ball behind for the corner. A lively start to the game. Into the first side by Coyle. And uh, the referee indicates a goal kick. A lot of movement inside the area as Fleming swings it in. The goalkeeper makes a great block there, but it's forced over the line, surely not. The referee's right there. No goal. Well, what a sigh of relief for Scott Howe and the Mullerwell defenders. Just look at this situation here. Mullerwell defence all over the place. Jerry Britton eventually got a touch on the ball. Just here, the goalkeeper made a good block. And then French come in. The referee was right up with the play here. And the ball just kept in play by Scott Howey. So his under gag has moved forward, so too has uh, Martin. And Kyle sends it in. In comes Mickey Weir! away in the far side, he was calling for it, here's him, here's French! And did Fellman have got the equaliser, with 38 minutes gone, and that's a bad goal for Motherwell to lose, after taking the lead. The experienced figure of him is French there. Well, Andy Smith was away on the far side, calling for the ball. And he got the touch this time, he wasn't uh, picked up on that occasion by van der Gag. Knocked it down into the path of Hamish French. The Marvel manager will not be happy. We are. Eddie B starts to run the support, but he clips it through looking for Tommy Coyne. And Coyne's on the end of it. And the goal line clearance from Andy Todd. Well, it was Andy Todd who made the mistake there of allowing Coyne away from him, but he recovered well right on the goal line. Well, Tommy Coyne looked as surprised as anyone that uh, he got a crack at goal there. He managed to beat the goalkeeper, but Andy Todd recovered. Long ball played through by Mickey Weir. Now look at Todd there, absolutely caught. It breaks through to Coyne, under the goalkeeper, and Andy Todd retrieved the situation. Get through by McMillan. Get off by Coyne, looking for Coyne to get in, through now for Britain, this is Smith, the chance on now for Bingham, oh terrific goal by Dunfermline, 58 minutes gone here, Mullow 1, Dunfermline 2, and he fairly buried that behind Scott Howe, it all began though with a Mullow mistake, but full credit to Dunfermline, they gave the ball away to Mullow and it's played through to Jerry Britton, touch here by Smith and just look at this effort going in from David Bingham how he had no chance Motherwell 1, Dunfermline 2 and this is a real setback for Motherwell as they struggle to stay in the Premier Division and avoid the playoff places Britain, Smith Bingham 2-1 It's Van der Gag who drives it through! 